Glenn, congratulations. Talk Thank about a impact substitution. No, it was good. Uh, I'm obviously delighted with it. I think when the team's named, when you you get to the ground, you're not starting. You're, of course, a little bit disappointed naturally, but you, you know that that's your job to be on the bench to come off and if you get a chance to make the difference. And thankfully, <laughs> it went to plan. You certainly did that. Did you have a clear idea of what you wanted to do to try and exploit St Mirren when you did come on? I think it was obvious I just needed to be direct. And w when I get the chance to come on, I, I need to make the most of it. Whenever I get the ball, if, if it's defending, that, that's a, the other side of the game. But also when I get it, going forward I just need to be as positive as I can and uh, yeah everything I did I, I think it, it went that way. Yeah it was a, a fantastic assist for you and clearly you stepped up with huge confidence at the free kick. Yeah no it's something I've practiced quite a lot uh, it's always nice when it, it comes off I had one last week at, at Hibs it didn't quite go to plan but no today, <laughs> today it did and I'm, I'm delighted. You've had to bide your time when it comes to the cup, cup competitions as well haven't you with the way the fixtures have worked out so I mean this must be extra special for you. Yeah no it is it was obviously it was the way it fell I couldn't really do anything about that um, but like I say it just comes back to making the most of every chance that I'm getting on the pitch um, and that's just about being confident and being positive and it's, it's about doing the right things and, and training every day it hopefully catches the manager's eye so that he, he has a trust in me to, to put me on and yeah thankfully today like I said it, it went to plan. You're certainly making a habit of scoring some big goals for this St Johnson side but what is it about this squad that is, is working so well under Callum Davidson? I think it's, it's, it's from the minute every day you walk into the training ground everyone's just uh, a genuine honest bunch everyone gets on really well um, um, and as soon as you step on onto the pitch every day at training, everyone's at it. You could have played a game two days before, but you're expected to train 100%. And of course, that's the way it should be, but, it, but everyone follows that. And I think that puts us in good stead that for the games that come at the weekend. And winning one cup is good enough, but now putting yourself on the verge of at least being in contention for the second one, it must be such a special feeling in that dressing room. Yeah, it's, it's massive. I think there was also a lot of the boys missed out this week through no fault of their own, of course, with coronavirus. Um, so it's massive for them as well. I think we've all pulled together really well as a squad this week um, and that's, we knew that's what we had to do to sort of make everyone proud and, and thankfully it's gone, gone to plan.